Hello class, welcome to the Minute Math YouTube channel. Please hit the subscribe button below and share our videos. You can also find great math content and links to all of our videos at www.minutemathtutor.com. Alright now, enjoy the lesson. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon and this is Minute Math and today we're learning about the greatest common factor for finding the GCF of each. So, if I was given these numbers, 66 y x and 30 x squared y. Okay? Well first I deal with the numbers. My smallest number is 30 and the factors of 30 are 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 10, 15, and 30. And now I'm going to try to see the largest one of these that also goes into 66. Well, 30 doesn't go into 66 because 30 times 2 is 60. 15, no, because we don't end in a 5 or a 0, guaranteed no. 10 doesn't go into 66, it goes into 60, okay? But 6 goes into 66 11 times. So 6 is my kicker here. So 6 goes in both of those numbers. It's sort of the greatest common factor is 66 and 30, so we have 6 there. Now we have 1y here, 1y there, so we're good, okay? 1y can go into both, and 1x here, 2x, so the least of the two is just 1x. And there we have our final answer, 6yx. So quick recap, we're given 66yx and 30x squared y. And we didn't find the GCF of that. Well, out of the numbers, we found the GCF to be 6, and there's a 1y in each and 1x in each. And that's it, so our final answer is 6yx. Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, the creator of Minute Math. And if you like this video, please hit the like button that's right there. If you have a mathematical question, just add it to the comment section below. And lastly, if you want to see more videos just like this one, hit subscribe. It's right there. But as always, thanks for watching.